Hello, my friends. You are listening to Everyday Happiness with Katie Jeffco, but today I'm Celie Cauley, and she's asked me to take over. One of the questions she asked me is, what advice would you give your younger self? And, you know, I am going to be 60 next year, so I feel like I can speak to this. And one of the things I always tell people who are younger than me is you don't have to do something just because you're good at it. And my experience was that I was a costume and set designer, and that's what I did. I got my bachelor's in fine arts, and that's what I did after college. But I realized it didn't bring me that much happiness. The example I give is I was doing a project for the Juilliard School, and not only did they pay me to design the costumes, they paid me to custom dye the silk chiffon. This was one of the best projects you could ever be in. It was a commissioned piece with a choreographer and I did the sets and costumes. And you would have thought when the curtains opened, I would have said, oh my goodness, there's my creative energies come to life. But all I really said to myself is, oh my goodness, when is this gonna be over? I've seen it a thousand times. And in that moment, I had an epiphany that just because I was good at it didn't mean that it was something I should do. And um, when the choreographer said, we've been hired to do another piece, I said, you know, I don't think so. My role models as successful costume designers are um, people who generally have sacrificed having families and children for their love of theater and film. And I don't see that happening to me. I want to have a a husband. I want to have a child. And that was when I decided not to pursue that career. So my advice to somebody younger is just because you're good at something doesn't mean you should do it and that that's your path to true happiness. So I hope that resonated with you. And I'm delighted I've got another question or two to answer for the rest of the week.